can public speaking be perceived as a weakness? We're going to find out in the video. Stay tuned. The answer is yes, it can. Here's a recent story, one that happened with, let's say, within the last few years. I don't remember his name. Something I'd have to Google. I'll let you know. A well-known executive was presenting, and who was not prepared. He was presenting to a live audience on TV, and he forgot what he was going to say. He wasn't prepared. He was arrogant. He was foolish. He thought he would just come out and wing it, wing it, wing it. No, not smart. When you're on live TV with millions of eyeballs watching you, I purposely left out his name. <laughs> you want to be prepared. Practice, prepare, speak in front of a camera, record yourself. He ruined his personal brand. The recovery has never come back for this man. What he did, he started to present about a particular topic. He got stuck, forgot his lines. He was ill prepared, and he ended up doing something very weak. He left the battle. He turned and walked off the stage, right in the middle of his presentation. So those that were around him had to pick up his pieces to make this work. So. Can public speaking be a weakness? Yes, it can if you're not prepared. Be prepared. If you want to be considered a pro and be considered excellent, do it. Prepare for it. Does somebody go enter Wimbledon without years and years of practice? They practice. They practice. They practice. They serve their volleys. When you are a speaker, it's no different. You must practice. Practice, 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 and then do it again. It can be a weakness if you're not prepared properly. So properly prepare, so you are never weak.